Let's go! Welcome guys, back in the garage again. Let's jump in. Uh, back on the Honda Civic MK5. Let's go! Right, I'm back in the garage. Um, I just want to point out that... Um, uh, Monkey said I didn't do the interior, uh, the seats and the steering wheel and whatnot. So I want to thank him for uh, pointing that out. Um, we have done all of in there. We're doing the engine build. We're doing the engine build. So let's dismantle it and I'll be right back. Welcome back. That was a little bit of a tricky one. Now I've added some stuff to my um I've added stuff to the inventory that I'm gonna buy. Um we are gonna buy some performance parts as well. Uh, so let's just let's quickly do this. Um I'm not gonna do the uh, clutch plate because the clutch plate mm, I don't really need them. <clears throat> I will do that engine um, head because I will sell them. Uh, when I go on barn finds, um, I actually go and look for engine blocks and engine heads and stuff like that. It covers my cost of um, of actually going there. So I'm going to click on there. I'm going to go to assembly and then I'm going to install this. So I'm going to do this and I'm not going to fast forward it. I'm going to show you what I do. So... Uh, we need that, so I'm going to push X to add it. Uh, now, if you didn't have the tablet, go back through to the bench and go to the computer and buy all your stuff. So we need to go in here. We need to go into the engine list and we need to buy the crank. OK, uh, that's the engine head. We need we don't need that. Where are the clips? No. Oh, that's not it. Where are the clips? I thought I added the clips. I think I have got clips anyway. So let's go and buy the performance parts for this. So close. Tune up. Go in here. So that's that's A head. Okay. Then we've got a B head. That's the manifold intake. Um, I think we're going to need two of these because there's two sides. There's an A and a B. Um, when I take, when I actually buy stuff, it actually takes it off of the list. Um, that is not in there. That is in there. I can't buy them. Can I not buy them? Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll buy them if we need them. Uh, what is that? Oh, ah. Can we not buy them then? Hmm, they're not performance then. Okay, we'll have a look at those in a minute. Let's get back to this. Um, and we'll assemble this. How is everybody doing? It is Friday. I do miss my streaming, guys. I only do this... Um, because I can do this at my leisure. With streaming, um, I am basically overtaxing my eye. And as I say, I do miss it. I miss it terribly, but I can only do what I can do around my vision. So. We haven't got a sump, so we're going to have to buy a sump. Um, I will flip it over as well. So I've decided actually what I'm going to do is rather than you watch me repair everything, I'm going to do that in fast forward mode. 
the assembly mode if it is needed what i will do is i will show you what i'm doing I'm going to need some more of these so what i'm going to do is i'm going to scrap these okay so i'm not going to scrap them i'm going to sell these and then we're going to use these performance parts so this is how you do it push the x key go into here go into performance go to your shopping list that's the head why did it mm -hmm. right let me do that again let me go in there and let me this do those because it seems to be doing something wrong right add it again i'm going to buy about four okay go to the shopping list i'm going to buy about let's buy six um and i will upgrade those for three stars not four stars three stars so there you go so let's flip it over i do not believe i've oh i have got one of those well i didn't realize i have one of those right um i need that one did i buy two of them no, I did buy two of them, so why haven't I got one of those then? You can make mistakes, even veterans like me. You can make mistakes, guys. I think I've got enough um i think i have got enough um oh yeah look we do need that that is not a performance part then i've got enough spark plugs and stuff like that what i will probably need is i will probably need um i'll probably need the uh, leads that come off of there to Oh, I did buy the wrong one. The leads that come off from the um, from the spark plugs. Don't want that. You need to go into there. I do need two of them. Oh, see that actually cancels it off, which is good. Um. Has this got one? I don't think it's got one, guys. So, the rotary arm. I don't think it's got it. So, maybe, let's put this together. That's a little bit shiny. Um, let me add that. Add that. This could be a high performance um, thing, whereas we don't need that, maybe. right we haven't got one of those so we're going to, have to get one of those as well um we're going to add that because that is basically the fuel rod basically this gives it a bit more high performance for going into this manifold here uh we probably will need the highfalutin um carburetors as well so let's go in there and get those So I need two of those. I need two of those. Um, did we buy those? No, we didn't buy those. So let me buy those. I will do the interior where we will uh, do the seat and stuff like that. Uh, in a moment we can't buy them in there so we got to buy two two yeah can I actually go over there and do that now and have a break from this because I don't like doing this all the time because you know what I end up and then I can show you what and then we can come back we can come back to this Let's put that on there. 
So this is going to be a seller. It's not going to be a keeper. Um, California Grease Monkey has said, am I going to go to the racetrack? Do you know what? I'm not very good. Um, you cannot connect. I've got a Logitech G29 wheel. Um, I've been very finding it very hard to actually um, basically go into the settings and get my wheel set up. Uh, I don't do mouse and keyboard. I don't do mouse and keyboard when I'm driving. Um, let's add that. Let's do the sparky plugs. And then we do the manifold. We get the top section off. Uh, let me add those because I will buy some more of those. Because I think we're going to be out for this. And then what we do is we go and transfer the car over. We do the headlight alignment and stuff like that. So let's go and do that now. So let's put the, the bonnet, or as you Americans call it, the hood down. Let's go over. No, I didn't want to do that. Stop it. Nope. Turn away. Back. Uh, let me go over there. This is where we will get. Now, if you got a lot of people have asked me is this as well. OK, a lot of people have said, why don't I go in here and diagnose? You can get in here and you can drive the car and diagnose it. It will go to here. It will do the rear brakes. It will go and do the front brakes and then it will do the shaky shaky to find out what suspension is broken and all the rest of that. So let's go in here. I'm going to go disassemble. But what I am going to do is I'm going to add that and I'm going to get two of those. I don't know why that brick is down there. I must be missing something here. So let's go back in there again. Disassemble. I'm going to go into, I'm going to have to come out of that mode. Yeah, we're missing something because look, it's on blocks here. And I don't know why that's on blocks. Um, hmm. Not a clue. Right. So in here, go into here. And now I can go into here and I can buy the steering wheel. I can buy the seats. I need two of them. We're going to have to find out about that. Go into here, into the assembly mode, and those horrible seats, which were looking all manky, are now sorted. So, we didn't buy that, but I don't understand why we are on blocks. I don't know why we're on box. Right, let's do the headlight alignment. There's no battery. Well, bugger my boots and call me Elvis. Right. Let's, have I got a battery in stock? Can I fit the battery in here? I don't think I can fit the battery in here, guys. It's not going to allow me to do it. Um, I don't, oh, it might do. Mm -hmm. do this I've got to do this on the uh, on the actual whatchamacallit so what I'm going to do is I'm going to transfer this back over to lift one we will raise this up yeah there's something I'm missing something on that and then we're going to go and put the we're going to put the battery in. I haven't got a battery, but I know I've got one on charge. I think I do. Yes. No, I haven't got a battery. Well, that is a shock horror. I normally have a battery, guys. I've always had a battery whenever we've got stuff around, but evidently I haven't got a battery. So, obviously, if you didn't have a battery, you can't do a uh, do a the alignment because if you go to a MOT's testing station, yeah, they have to switch the lights on, uh, and then they align them with that little gizmo, 
and then they align the lights. Right, let's go back and do the engine build. Let's bring that back down. I don't understand why we can't take these fins off and I don't understand why it's not letting us go on the, on the ground. Well, that's a bit weird, isn't it? That's a bit weird. Yeah, look. I need um, the high performance. Um, let's find it. There it is. So we'll buy that one. Yeah, for some unknown reason, these... This is not a mod, is it? Is it a mod? No, this is not a mod. This is not a mod. So why does it do this? I don't know. Because look, this is the... This is the skirt that runs along there. So... I don't know why I can't take this off. That is weird. Look. <laughs> oh well. I'm not saying anything. I am not saying a word. Right, I'll be back in a minute. Let me just do this quick and I'll be back in two minutes, guys. Welcome back. Um, so I've looked it up whilst I've been doing that. I've looked it up and I don't see that there's anything the reason why that shouldn't be on the ground, why it should be on bricks. With the build, um, I did have all the rest of the components. I might not have these components, so let me add them. So we need that. We need that crank flywheel. We need these. So I will go and buy them. I don't know whether I've got these. I haven't. So let me add those. Have I got one of those? I haven't got one of those. So I'm pushing the X key to add all this stuff to the event tree. Um, I have got a high performance one of those. And I have got these. I will discard that. But I will do that off camera. Um... Let's do that. I feel like I'm missing something, actually. Um, now, there are no... I looked that up as well. There are no uh, trend... There's, this is a high performance. So these have got heated plugs here. Uh, and that goes with the fuel rods. Uh, and that goes with these. So this is a really flying machine. As well as, I believe, this is a drag as well. So I haven't got and I can't test it out. I can't go on the drag strip because I don't own it. Um, I, I, I'm, I'm reluctant to pay £16 for for just so I can go and drag race with my friends. Uh, I'm not going to do it. So there you go. So let's go and buy this stuff. Um, so we need we need the oil filter. Yes, please. We need... How many ideal wheels did it say we needed? Now we need one of those. So this gives you an indication of how many you need. I've got one, so I only need to get two of those. So I need one of those. I only need two of those. Okay. Um, so I can X off that. Um, I need one of those because I haven't got one. Um, I need that one, which is the B. That's the cover. And I need one of those as well. 
and then if we have a look at the shopping list it's empty so there you go so let's put this sucker together oh i need a belt when we put all this in we need the timing we need the actual tensioner there's a tension that runs in between here uh for the actual the belt that runs the top cam uh the oil pump to circulate the uh water and that's all run by the the upper crank and lower crank it's all connected together and a to charge the battery you'll see what i mean in a minute it make all make sense so there's the belt which runs from here to here to here um and this basically is connected to the oil pump which sits behind here um and that actually makes the oil run all the way through the top and then yeah as i say you've got the sump which is down here uh, and it keeps everything all fluid uh, and everything will not because if it's not done it will um, basically it, the engine will seize so let's go in there let's get that belt because we need it and a plus there's the water pump as well so there's the tensioner i said that we needed i'm not too sure whether i have one i might already have one but let's buy one it's always best to have a spare i only had one anyway which was the one i bought so there you go one engine one engine complete let's take a uh that take a screenshot of that because that's going to be the pin for the youtube so there you go so now as i said in previous i'd like to get hold of this and will that through but they didn't think of that so let's take that off we can then we should actually this is what we should do the only thinking map we should move that to here or basically and then move this there should be a bar across this two people should one should be holding the engine this is why i've said to the developers why don't you make this multiplayer wrench is going to be multiplayer when they've actually finalized it so yeah one holding the engine so it doesn't swing around one using the back and wheeling it through to the engine so uh yeah i suppose it is what it is at the end of the day that's how they wanted to do it that's how it's going to be done so there you go we could go through this but this is all tickety boot and then it's in and then what i'm going to do is i'm going to move that out of the way uh let's put this up in the air um let's do see now this is do you know i said in the in the previous stream that i hate mods that are not properly done this is not a mod let me quickly show you this is not a mod if it was a mod or dlc it would have a banner here this is purely car mechanic simulators fault here i'm going to point the finger royally at them this is one of marvin's pets hates now this is supposed to be look this here the front exhaust going up to the manifold this is going through there okay my pet hate this drive shaft how this would drive would, would only be imaginable this is too low and the drive shaft how this drives it god only knows because there's no drive shaft connecting this to this it is it's my it, honestly guys it's my it's my pet hate i really don't like it and if i would have known it i wouldn't have youtubed it but i'm showing it off because you know uh no we don't want that i want a high performance thank you known then i would have i would have done it uh let's go there let's go into high performance 
just one of my just one of my pet hates is all i'm gonna leave it there because i will keep going on and on and on as normal it's just i mean right now we put the uh, engine in there should be a split diff here connecting this and this to be four wheel drive okay um this should be connected somehow with like um possibly um a thing that comes down here and this should be connected this is not thought out by the developers not in a long shot We're going to see how much money we're going to make on this. I still haven't done this because we can't, they don't know what we're missing. Uh, let me put that in. Uh, that's done. Make sure we've got all of the bushes. Front. Rear. I think we have. Um, I did say in the previous uh, YouTube, I never, if I'm going to do a build... And I'm going to sell this for pure profit. Obviously, if this was a keeper, I'd put fluid in. I'd put in the coolant. I'd put in the brake fluid. Yeah, I'd put in the power steering. But this is going to be sold. So there you go. So let's bring that down. Uh, let's take this outside. And I bet you this puts it on bricks. Or well, it hasn't put it on bricks. Yes, it is. It's still on bricks. Well, there you go. Let's put the hood on. Marvin is done. There you go, guys. We completed it. Let's have a look here how much money we're going to make on it and how much money we spent. So it's not completely done. There's something that we're missing here with the parts, but I don't care. So we made, basically... Uh, performance parts we put 56547 um we did um the actual value of the car is pretty good uh the base price is that we've made a clear profit a clear profit of 160 176 616 credits so we can sell this for 191806 it's a winner winner chicken dinner for me. Boom. Right, there you go, guys. Let's go. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. We're going to be looking for the RAM next time, guys. Take care. Happy Friday. And I'll catch you very, very soon. Remember to like and subscribe. And please.